We all of us know at least a few riddles. After all, they make up the historical, educational, and ethical systems that govern the High Ones realm. They are a way to convey our oral traditions, our history, to those who come after us. And they're a way to make sure that we understand the world that we live in. While I'm no riddle master and I haven't studied at the College at Caithnerd, I'm going to try and explain to you how riddles function and how they're made up. Each riddle is composed of the riddle itself, its answer, and its stricture, the moral that's supposed to be conveyed by the riddle. I'm going to read you one that I find particularly affecting. The riddle is, who was Kern of Head and what pursued him? The answer is as follows. Kern of Head was pursued one day by a thing without a name. The thing called his name over and over. He ran from it, going into his house of seven rooms and seven doors, and locking each door behind him until he came to the innermost chamber, where he could run no farther. And he heard the sound of one door after another being torn open, and his name called each time. He counted six doors open, his name called six times. Then, outside the seventh door, his name was called again, but the thing did not touch the door. Kern waited in despair for it to enter, but it did not. Then he grew impatient, longing for it to enter, but it did not. Finally, he reached out, opened the door himself, but the thing was gone, and he was left to wonder all the days of his life what it was that had called out to him. The stricture is answer the unanswered riddle, which means that you must pursue that which pursues you, otherwise it will take control of the rest of your life, whether you want it to or not. Consider that in many ways, a riddle is like a house. The riddle itself is the framework. It is the question that begs an answer. Much like the facade of a home invites guests. The answer to the riddle fills in the interior of the house. It gives you the context of what the riddle is about. It is the windows and doors. It is the furniture and occupants. Without the answer, a riddle is meaningless. Much in the same way, without occupants, a home has no purpose. The stricture is the foundation of the house. It is the base upon which the riddle rests. But you cannot get to the structure of the house, to its base, without first entering in. In much the same way, you cannot get to the stricture of a riddle without trying to answer it. Remember, friends, don't run from that which pursues you. Always answer the unanswered riddle. 